Hi guys, nice to be back on YouTube. Life is Strange, True Colors, brand new Life is Strange game. Let's get right into it. This is a beautiful, very beautiful menu screen. I was excited about the level design in this game. It looked like it was going to be really cool. Oh no, my actions have consequences. <gasps> so, Alex, the day's finally here. You've been at the Helping Hands group home for eight years. We've been through a lot in that time. We have. And now you're finally leaving to live with your brother. My brother Gabe. It says here he lives in Haven Springs, Colorado. Is that correct? That's a big move. Do you have any plans as far as school or a job? Smoke crack. My brother said I might pick up a few shifts at the bar he works at. So you'd be dealing with people. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Does your brother know about your issues? Is that an official interview question, Dr. Lin? Alex, you know that I care about you. With everything that has happened, I just want what's best for you. He doesn't know. No one will once I leave this place. I'll just be a normal girl in a normal town. Until I pop off. <laughs> I mean, I might get a little crazy. I have a feeling something's going to happen because there there's a whole darn game about it. <laughs> All right. We look so cute. That's the main character. All right. I'm ready to move to my new mountain life. Dealing with people, though. Whew. Very bus America. <laughs> Why is that so funny to me? Very bus. Very bus. Very, very bus. Couldn't be any more bus. Is what it is, Patch. Gabe said to meet him at the bridge. I can't wait to see him. See, look, this is what I was excited about. Look at this cute town. A little laggy. We're pretty adorable. Wait, is this our house? Shit. I was about to go explore. It's a nice ass house, dude. You know that's expensive as shit. Well, look at all the beautiful flowers, too. Why is this fucking square? Wait, you guys don't see the square. On my recording software, there's just a big black square on my game from the menu screen. Uh, I'll just ignore it. Because it doesn't seem to be on the recording software. ASMR. Wow. Gorgeous. Oh, you can actually see like lenses. They were like reflecting. Usually like <laughs> video game characters with glasses. They don't you always kinda looks like fake glasses sometimes. These look good. Oh hi! Would you like to be my dinner? No? Okay, fine. <gasps> wow. Those flowers are thick. Was this the AMR section of the game? It's making me want to go to sleep. I like the ASMR videos on YouTube when I'm sleeping. It's so nice. <gasps> oh, let me pet the bird. Did she stop at the dispensary before she got on the bus? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, leave. See, Alex. I told you guys there's a black box blocking like half my screen. I didn't see that. I was going to be stuck there forever in ASMR land. Holy shit. That's really him. Oh my God, is our brother hot? I mean, <laughs> that sounds so weird. That sounds so weird. <laughs> 
Not like that. Oh. What's the protocol for reuniting with your long-lost sister after eight years? Handshake. I guess we can hug. I'm cool with the hug if you are. Wait, has consequences? <laughs> is the oh, consequences? Oh, my ribs still oh. part of the protocol. <laughs> Broken ribs. It's just so good to see you again. I can't believe you're here. Believe it. So, oh. That aura. She's all grown up. And I missed it. No. <laughs> I'm a lot taller, huh? Yeah, yeah. Time will do that to you. Are you ready to see the town? Oh no, people are gonna like. Let's do it. Hell yeah, let's rock and roll. I don't know why I said that. Me neither. <laughs> but I love the enthusiasm. Okay, the uh, Black Lantern is just up the street. I mentioned I live above a bar, right? Even better. Dude, doing cus a customer service job and you can hear what you people are wiped. thinking. I'm good. Hell no. The drive <laughs> through the mountains was amazing. You'd get so mad. Eleanor, hey, Alice just got here. Alex, meet Eleanor Laith, owner of the flower shop, and honest to God, royalty of Haven Springs. Oh, it is so nice to finally meet you. Welcome. Well, oh. back off, oldie. We are so glad to have you, Alex. Gabe told us all about you. I'm glad to be here. We're in a fight, I know it. I'm gonna bop her right in the head. She seems nice. <gasps> Yeah, Does she's she? Great. Does she though? A little quick on the draw with hugs though. Yeah, no shit. Welcome to Haven. <gasps> Cute. I'll live here. It looks nice. Oh yeah, let's go get some weed. And go kayaking in that. <laughs> I don't know if that looks, is good if we're a beginner. It's nice. Come on. There's a waterfall. Let's go down the waterfall, fuck it. Is this the first official stop on the tour? Absolutely. If you follow me inside, you'll find a prize exhibit. Gabe Chen buys makeup flowers for angry girlfriend. Oh, I can't wait. It's gotten so so reviews. <laughs> Good drama. Hey, Gabe. Riley, meet my sister, Alex. What's your greatest weakness? Uh, what? It's for a college interview. We've been debating this one for days. Gabe insists that I give an honest answer. It's always better to give an honest answer. And what's the alternative? Lying? Not lying, more like strategic half-truthing. Like, I work too hard, or I save too many puppies. Like a job they interview? I can smell that bullshit a mile away. I've been trying to warn her. Oh, yeah? What would you do? Oh, um, I would be clever. Yeah. I mean, honest. You can have weaknesses that are probably like a good thing and a bad thing. Oh my god, what if she just starts thinking, like, she's uglier than I thought? <laughs> oh my god. That would be so awkward, dude. This power is gonna be weird. I would be honest. It's usually harder, but then you come off as more authentic. Don't roll your eyes at me, Called bitch. It. Wow. You two are already wonder twinning your way through town. Seems that way. <laughs> Alex, help me out real quick. What do I get for Charlotte? Sunflowers are her favorite, but I read online that Lily of the Valley is great for saying sorry. What do you think? Oh, uh, you know, Lily of the Valley. I mean, sunflowers are pretty sweet too, I guess. Go with the white bouquet. If you're trying to say sorry. That I am, and that I will. <laughs>
You know, if Mac brought me flowers half as often, well, he wouldn't be Mac. Oh my God, what's Is the drama? So Tell us, PC? girl. Sort of. More on right now, but wait five minutes and ask again. <laughs> Put this on my tab? Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to just tell Mac about the interview? Wait, where the fuck are the sister just moved here flowers? Where are mine? No, not yet. I'll handle it. Our brother ripped okay, us off. Your call. We can leave when you're ready. Sounds good. Might as well have a look around before we leave. Yeah, where's my flowers? Let me pick something out. Mandatory for any enchanted garden. <gasps> Enter. Oh, okay. I hope Charlotte likes the lilies. If she doesn't, she can go die in a fire. And we won't care. Hopefully my advice doesn't derail her entire life. I'm sure it's fine. I mean, maybe she won't die in a fire. That's a little extreme. Aw, I wonder who they are. Cute, right? Ooh, what's in the yeah. back? Where's the money? Are those your grandparents? No, but they were like family. Alistair and Ava Murphy. Nana bought the building from them before I was born. Where's Nana's money? <laughs> you can always steal money on these games. You gotta be on the lookout for it. Birdhouses? Hell yeah. Dude, I just, we set up our birdhouses recently. We like filled them up. Four raccoons tried to snatch that the shit. The house movement is really taking off. Is that wearing a Cheeto shirt? Uh, excuse me. This gnome has been places. I don't like gnomes, to be honest. Like, can we be over gnomes? Can we do like, I don't know, decorative birds like the flamingos instead? Perfect. Sims 4 ruined the gnomes. That guy's bad to the gnome. Right? I heard he won the Nobel Peace Prize. Oh God, please stop. No problem. <laughs> she hates us. She hates us. <gasps> you can make anything pretty if you shove a bouquet inside. <gasps> oh my God, I don't know about that. I, I didn't think of a few places where if I shove the bouquet, I don't think it will look good. Ready. Oh, I actually wanted to click the thing beside the door, but okay. Thanks. See you soon, Rai. <laughs> Who? Haven drugs. What kind of drugs? Let's stop there. Let's stop at the dispensary. Oh my god, is there going to be a ladder accident? How long have you and Charlotte been dating? About three years now, I think. You must spend a lot of money on bouquets. She's worth it. Okay, Is she though? Great. I'll be Just the. Watch your feet. Yeah. I'll decide. Do you need me to hold the ladder? Watch your feet now. It's getting windy. Dude, My fall, feet are fine. fall, fall. I just don't want you to fall. You need stable feet with ladder work. Why don't you hold the Enough fucking ladder then, asshole? Hey, don't get snippy with me, pal. <gasps> I'm just saying, my uncle Albert fell off a ladder once when he was repainting his roof. Beautiful mahogany color, you should have seen it. Anyway, broke his whole arm. The whole thing. Oh. Sounds awful. It was. He couldn't feed himself for a month. Why didn't he use his other arm? What's that now? Oh my god. His other arm. Why didn't he use his other arm to eat? You know what? <laughs> what? I'm not sure. No Wait. one ever asked that before. Yeah, because you're a fucking you know liar. What? And a fraud. And we see your lies. I'm stealing this. Bro, I'm gonna like scream. Why is the game doing this to me? These are really nice. Thanks. I hand wove every wreath myself. Wow. You should start a business. It's not about the money, Alex. It's not? I mean, okay. I guess well, not. Here we are. What's that? Mining company. Wow. Good to know. Scary. 
Yo, well, what are they are. mining? Can we steal it? Okay. Hold on. Let me try not to be criminal for two seconds. <gasps> Goat yoga ad. What? I want to join it. Wow. Just. Wow. Oh. Never mind. I thought there would be like goats there. How uh, cute. Do yoga with baby goats. What the shit is goat yoga? Yoga. With goats. <gasps> it is then? Welcome to Colorado. I will do it. I bet Gabe keeps the flower shop in business all by himself. Gabe Chen, flower delivery man. I know, right? Let me duck in here and smooth everything out. It'll only be a minute. I'll introduce you properly later. Once, you know. Wait, it's she no works problem, at the dispensary? Really. Grab me some weed, too. Give me some freebies. Shit. It's gonna be longer than a minute. Trust me. Who the fuck are you, bitch? Oh. Hi there. Gabe's your brother, right? I'm Ethan. Charlotte's my mom. Who the hell is Charlotte? Hi, Ethan. Did I meet I'm her? Alex. What you reading? Oh, the Frank girlfriend. Warden. Oh, has she found the scepter of serenity yet? <gasps> oh, I thought she She's spoiled it. She's looking for the scepter, but I think she'll need the bangle of vanishing to get to it. I prefer the fire ring. I'd rather shoot fire from my hand, burn all my enemies to a crisp. What if you're high-fiving a friend and the fire ring goes off? Risky. Worth <laughs> it. If you like comics, I can show you the one I'm making. No thanks. No, I'm joking. I'd love to see it. I don't want to be mean to the little kid. I woke up on the wrong side of the bed today. You can keep it if you want. I made a bunch of copies to sell in the record store. Ah, uh, this is wholesome. awesome, Ethan. I can't wait to read it. Are you going camping? You know the mines? I know they exist. Oh my god, let's go a steal shit from them. All around the mountains. I think I found a way into one. I mean, I'm not an expert on old mines, but that would scare the crap out of me. I just like to explore sometimes. It's no big deal. Yeah, until you get stuck and upside down and fucking die in oh, 24 man. hours like that one creepy I story. I told you that. I know we just met, but be careful out there, okay? He's gonna die. You don't need to worry. Really. <laughs> Famous last word. I think I'll check out that record store. Nice meeting you, Ethan. Bring me back some Levi's, old Levi's you find on mine. Those are worth some money. If we want our own house in Colorado, we're going to have to start saving now. <laughs> Stealing old Levi's and robbing the flower store. Oh, wow. This place reminds me of the shop Gabe and I used to go to. <laughs> He'd save up for weeks from his shitty car wash job just to buy us something to listen to. It's crazy. Here I am, years later, still waiting for my big brother in the record store. Except this time, I'm buying the record. Ooh, how much money you got? What are we buying? No way. Oh, is that, um, Steph from uh, the other game? I know she's in this. Oh, yeah, I think so. Whoa, can you be a lesbian with her? Oh, uh... Oh, uh, unicorn. Damn, she's look, look at her. Look at us checking her ass out. She's looking her up Citizens and down. Citizens of Heaven Springs, that was the Wednesday with Bomb Squad. 
Up next, a very special request from some chick. Whoa, she called us some chick. Oh my God. <laughs> Damn, okay. Interesting. Sorry, the store's actually closed right now, which is confusing because it's obviously open. Wait, are you Alex? That's me. Wow. Gabe's been talking about you coming since forever. I'm Ryan. Ah! She looks so scared when he appeared. Hi, Ryan. <laughs> he just came up. Nice to us. meet you. She's getting bad vibes, you could tell. So, all the way from Portland, huh? What do you think of Haven? I've seen some cool things so far. Like, this record store is amazing. I didn't expect anything like this here. Yep, it's our cultural landmark for sure. So, the store is closed, but they opened it just for you? You must be picking up something pretty important. Yeah, well, you could say that. An outdoorsman's guide to the calls of common birds. Wow, that's... I want to go bird watching. Not what I was expecting at all. It's a pretty obscure record. <laughs> the National Park Service gave it five stars. <laughs> so, you're a... Colorado State Park Ranger. It's all coming into focus. Oh my god, he's gonna murder the well, little boy. Bummer, the store's closed. I was thinking of getting a gift for Gabe, but I'll figure something else out. Then throw him in the mine shaft. <gasps> I don't even know if he still listens to records. I might be jumping he to does. conclusions. Charlotte just got him a record player for his birthday. I'm pretty sure he put something on hold. So you don't work here? Steph won't mind. It'll be the easiest sale she's ever made. If I could just find the whole list. Hmm. What the hell is this dude doing? <sighs> Damn. I know I saw it before. Want to help me look? No, I'm not getting into oh, yeah. trouble. Any ideas on where to start? No idea. Steph leaves stuff all over the place. I don't want to make Steph mad. She already called me some chick. Like, we're making progress. The fuck? Oh my god, is there a kitty yet? Oh my god. Hi. Wait. Hi, black kitty. Is that the hold list? Scare? No, don't scare it. Move it nicely. Don't freak out. I'm just gonna... Okay, oh. just kidding. Oh, my cat's right here. I'm gonna pet her. With both your hands. Thing is, she's sitting on the hold list. We could use her toy to lure her away. If we can find it. Give me a Wait, hand. Can Steph see us? Shit, she can see us. I was gonna say, we could scare it. But maybe we should Maybe we shouldn't. If we're trying to get it in. <gasps> Emergency guitar. In case of sweet jam sesh, break glass. Pride piano, bubble gum. Ooh, fire rock. Wasn't the fire one in another game? Wait, chore calendar. Chores are an excellent way to learn personal responsibility, Alex. <laughs> <gasps> Let's creep. I love that this town has their own radio station. Huh. Colorado digs its alt rock, I see. Ooh, it's in here. Gabe's record is in here, but which one is it? Touch and die. Is it wrong that the note makes me want to touch it more? I know. Oh no. Oh no. Do we do it? What is there cameras? Will she know? Do we jeopardize our relationship? Touch it. Just once, just a little. Oh no, she's gonna. Trying to die? 
I wanted to see what would happen. You're just lucky Steph's behind a soundproof wall. We're safe. Hey, luck or not, I've officially cheated death. It's been so long since I've played. Gabe and I used to dream about cutting demos all the time as kids. Never got there. Oh, that's not a mirror. <laughs> what? Perpetual motion. Looks exhausting. In these troubling times, the world could really use more rock songs with clarinet solos. How do I get a rich Polish clarinetist to buy me things? Right? Life age long question. Oh, action figures. Do I collect those? Oh, wait, no, we can't just steal them from the store. This place has just the right amount of dorkiness. Any luck finding that cat toy? Not yet. So, what's the prediction? What do you think Gabe listens to these days? Dude, just grab a string. Grab a fucking string. It's not that difficult. Look, we got a headset on. Just like, well, maybe it's MP3. It doesn't have a string. You know, uh, probably Screamo. I think Gabe's gotten so emo that he doesn't like instruments anymore. Just dudes screaming and crying into the microphone. Yep. Dear God, let's hope not. <laughs> well, there's only one way to find out. Let's see if we can find that cat toy. I'll just search Looks this like random metal box. Here. What if he exclusively listens to Smash Mouth? Wait for it cover bands. Ugh. I disown him. <laughs> Damn. Dude, like, literally whip one of those across the room. It might work. Cats aren't picky. Maybe in the junk box. Dude, there's like 50 things. Look, there's a cat toy right there. Look, it has the string and the long sticky thing. Oh. And we have a winner. Good guess. <laughs> Not the toy I was looking at, but okay, I'll take it. Be safe out there. If I die a horrible cat-related death, tell Gabe I'm sorry. Hopefully we won't have to eat the cat and lose the girl. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the superior mammal now? All right. <laughs> Good idea. Wholesome. Thanks. For a guy who lives in the woods, I'm pretty good at this customer service thing. Action packed. All right, now we need to get the toy back from the cat. Can we lure Steph with it? Oh, cat bowl. What's it eating? Valkyrie. That's one badass cat name. Wait, what was that? Um, hello? Wait, why is... Okay, I guess they're all like that. Interesting. I think the colors... The color is important in this game. Like, from the auras and... I'm assuming it matters other times, too. Okay. Kings of Leon. Should have known. Wait. Seriously? Gabe and I used to listen to records together all the time. We'd forget about the world and rock out for hours. You gotta tell me what Gabe was like as a kid. Any ammunition you can give me? <laughs> dork! He acted cool, but he was really a big dork. Like, one time he was pretending to stage dive and fell off the bed, sprained an ankle. It was funny. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you being here is a game changer in the Gabe embarrassing department. All right, you're looking at 
20 even. Bitch, I don't have money. Give it to me for free. I'm new to the town. Or this is like newbie freebie. Oh no, no way. I can't believe you're doing this no. again. Come on. Do you have any idea how much time I've put into this? You just... No, dude. I can't come over there. I'm working. <sighs> it's called a job. Maybe you'd understand if you ever had... I can watch the boost if... You gotta get out of here. Hey, hold, hold on a sec. Are you serious? Hmm, you have a playlist, right? I think I can handle that. You're a lifesaver. Oh, no bird calls, though. I'll be there, one sec. <sighs> Organizing a LARP shouldn't be this hard. Are you okay? Uh, well, <laughs> we will not give up our secret. I'm great, thanks. Just, did she say organizing a LARP? <laughs> yep. Beyond DJing, Steph's also queen of the Haven nerds. Sounds like there's some unrest in the kingdom. I'm about to put some unrest in this kingdom. <sighs> Somehow I knew I'd find you in here. Things went well with Charlotte? Thanks to your help. I can't wait for you guys to meet. I think you'd be great friends. We'll see. Speaking of, my two favorite people in my favorite place. What have you guys been up to? You know, talking about bird calls and bird call related media. This guy really loves his birds. Guilty. Birds are kind of cool. You know we're trying to keep her in Haven, right? Anyway, I'm glad you two met. Not only is this dude my best friend, he's the best guide to Haven you could ever find. And this dude hands me the best beers? What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> By the way, oh. Mac was in here earlier, and uh, he really wants to talk to you. Mac? He knows where to find me. Anyway, my shift starts in 20. Ready to go? Take along? I'll catch up. I got a radio show to host. Is it about birds? Well, some of the, like, interactions with people are, like, a little weird. Like, they have them, like, shifting their eyes and stuff. I should check in. Do you mind? No, yeah, of course. What up, Monster Slayer Thanor? Hey. One week to the LARP, you stoked? Hell yeah. Had a boy. No, we gotta talk road trips next. It's a long drive to Denver. Are we driving with Steph? We'll see. She's a GM, so she's gotta be in Denver pretty early. What are you doing tonight? Mom says I'm supposed to stay at the Lantern until she gets off work. But I kind of want to hang out at home. Is that okay? No. To the streets with you. Do you, man. <laughs> but I'm going to check that homework later tonight, though. Better be done, Capiche. Capiche, good to meet you. Yeah, same. See you around. Dude, he's going to die in a mine. So weird seeing you do the dad thing. Dad thing? No, 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 no. No, no, I'm better than a dad. I'm like dad plus. <laughs> Not for long. We trust each other. He tells me stuff he doesn't even tell Char. Ethan didn't tell Gabe about going to explore the old mine. Snitch. He trusted me to keep his secret. Should I? Or should I blow his cover? Hell no, I'm snitching. Tell. <laughs> uh, I should probably tell you something. That's danger. Sure. Earlier, you at least when know. Ethan and I were talking, he mentioned exploring some old mine. Oh, man. He seemed like he knew what he was doing, but I thought you'd want to know. 
this fucking kid. I'm gonna tell Charlotte. Just give me a sec. I still want the kid to die. Ooh, Heath is in trouble. And really? I feel responsible. We'll see. I appreciate you telling me. You, you did the right thing. Yeah. I know. What do you say we get you settled in? Can't have that kid exploring the mine. I need to explore the mine and find all the treasures. <laughs> Cute. So, this is what a mining town looks like. Well, this is pretty nice more guys one. and overalls running around. With soot all over their faces? Exactly. What do they mine here, though? Used to be silver back in the day. And now? Uranium. They blow these big holes in the mountains and sell it off to nuclear power plants. Oh. Yeah. We'll actually be able to hear a blast later tonight. It's pretty intense. Sounds like it. Look who it is. Jed! Hey, got someone I want you to meet. Alex, this is my buddy Jed. Buddy hell, will you listen to this horse shit? His boss, he means. You own the Black Lantern. Wait, so that's my the boss too then. 12 years or so. Time to suck up. Good to up. meet you, Alex. Heard a hell of a lot about you. Oh? Only bad stuff. Mostly lies. Your brother's full of shit. You know that? <laughs> he just about wet himself waiting for you to get here. <laughs> I was excited to see him, too. Guess we're an almost wet yourself kind of family. Oh. Ha! <laughs> I like her. Yeah, she's okay, I guess. We're heading in. You coming? Uh, in a minute. Supposed to meet Eleanor to talk spring festival decorations. He tell you about the festival yet? Not in detail. I'll fill you in later. Like, you do not want to get this guy started. I'm loquacious, goddammit. It's charming. Oh, before you leave, word of warning. Max got that old bug up his ass again. So I've heard. Yeah. So just, you know, eyes open. Anyway, you guys go settle. Alex, pleasure. I'll mind, Jed. So, spring festival equals mountain prom. It's a lot cooler than it sounds. Not possible. I'm picturing some straight up wicker man shit. I am oh, so ready before. for the festival. Let's do this. Hopefully the customers aren't bitchy. I mean, that would suck. But it's a video game, so we can pop off on them with no consequences. Very nice. Oh, wait, we live here too? I might have forgotten that. Shit, man. Not bad. This will do. This is all yours? Don't sound so surprised. Best you could do, damn. When you said that you had a nice place, I was picturing small but homey. Well then, welcome to my crib. This is on like Main Street. <laughs> this is nice. Seriously, this is great. And the best part is, it's actually yours. I'm mostly staying at Charlotte's now. Oh, shit. Time to Airbnb that shit for some money. Woo! <laughs> nice. We came Dude, up. I love it. Good. I mean it. I don't know what to say. You can say thank you. Or maybe you're the best. Or I'm definitely naming my first and third born children Gabriel or Gabriella? <laughs> sure thing. Did 
Didn't we already do the whole staring at me thing? There has been a lot of that. Just, you look a lot like how I imagine you'd be. Yeah? Do I look how you expect it? I honestly didn't expect you to have a beard. Oh, well, they didn't tell you? When you move to Colorado, you automatically get an amazing beard, a pretentious knowledge of craft beers, and a Subaru. Yeah, Funny. sounds right. I didn't get any of those things. Don't worry, I will stop yeah, at nothing our to get you your very own Colorado welcome kit. <laughs> Good, because I actually got you something. Wait, what? Whoa! Surprise. Wait, is this... This is the album I requested. I know. I'm good. I was gonna get this for you. Well, I got it for you first, so I get the credit. Uh, I'm gonna guess that's not gonna play because I have the copyright music turned off because, you know, YouTube. Oh, yes. Such a good song. I love this song. <laughs> Oh yeah, jam it out. <laughs> Yo, we came up though. We got this nice studio right on God, Main Street. I can't get Street. over this. Feels just like old times. We got called some chick by a cute girl. There was also a hot oh, no. park ranger backup plan. I can't. It's too late. <laughs> Go get him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, go get him, bro. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Lifetime of practice. <laughs> this seems very odd <laughs> without their music. Oh, God, don't broom me, please. <gasps> oh, it's here you. Your turn. All right, here's how it's done. Fine. Whoa! Oh my God, we're killing it. It would be so great if someone walked in right now. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Stomping is hilarious. Uh. You haven't lost a beat. <laughs> yeah, where's the beat? <laughs> oh fuck, who's that? Why they? It's the fucking police. Police knock, dude. They didn't announce themselves. Just give me a sec. Yeah. Who the hell are you? Hey, Mac. Can I help you? Something's wrong. I read Riley's phone. I know you've been meeting with her behind my back. It's not what you think, Mac. Oh, good. Because I thought you were fucking my girlfriend. Dude, I promise you've got it all wrong. Tell me why I shouldn't kick your ass ah! right now. No. No, 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 not here. No, no, not here. It's not my place, Mac. You really need to talk to your girlfriend. I'm talking to you! Oh shit. Oh no! No! Where's the gun? Stay! Stay! The fuck! The fuck! Away from her! Away from him! Oh, damn. Fuck off, bitch. Get out of our house. You're lucky we didn't have a home defense shotgun. Alex, stop! Stop! I don't have to stop, bitch. I have a right to self-defense. Gabe, I didn't... It's okay. Okay. 
Don't let this bitch in next time. <laughs> Get out. Get out of our house. Leave. Move along, sir. Don't point your fucking finger. Fucking psycho. Uh, really, dude? Did you look at your own behavior? You both go fuck yourselves. Fucking weirdo. I'm so sorry. Don't worry about it. Oh, taking a pee. <laughs> the fucking pees. Oh, it's probably the sink. I thought fuck. it was peeing. <laughs> It's like, okay, whizzing noise. What's the problem? Why can't we beat his ass? Like, he started it. Wait, Gabe. Alex. It's fine. Like, you're welcome. I gotta go stop my shift. Great. So how does this work like she feels their emotions and then she kind of did what he did like she said what he said and then attacked but then i just read this <laughs> the book um man it was really good parable of the shower it's like a post-apocalyptic thing and like the main character can like if someone gets hurt she feels that i'm but okay I'm okay. I'm okay. <gasps> Whatever. I'm glad we beat his ass. I guess I might as well unpack. Like, just dump your girlfriend. Leave us alone. Anyways, back to my dope ass apartment. Yo, we should invest in like some weaponry though. Let's be real. Some weirdos so far. Gabe always wanted a bike like this. That guy, the old lady. I don't know who I can trust here. Shoo shoo? Oh God. Shushu's gonna look so grungy on this nice bed. Aw, hi Shushu. She's gotten me through some hard times, but I was hoping we were done with that. No, throw her in the washer. Wholesome. We should write a full on review. Ethan's really talented. The tunnel to the monster stronghold of Demonheim collapsed. Oh my god, he's gonna go in the mine and it's gonna collapse on him. I'll have to find another way in. <gasps> The uniform of the city guard, long dead from the looks of it. Blood? The trail seems to end here, unless hollow. Aha, he must have crawled through here. The corpse of a cloud serpent it must have crashed through the ceiling. Perhaps if I can reach higher ground, I can find the secret entrance. Your flying days are over, cloud serpent, but you may still be of use to me. That glow beyond the peak, that must be the stronghold's back gate, wow. You know what? Good job, kid. Ooh, unpack letters? What's the drama in those? All right, look. I never heard back from Sydney. I hope she's okay. Hey, Alex, what's up? You're still at Helping Hands? Just so you know, I'm going to delete my accounts and lay low for a while. I hooked up with this, this asshole a couple times for a place to stay. Now he's harassing me. Also, I'm leaving Burnside. The supervisor's a racist and keeps accusing me of, of dealing. I'll hit you up if I find a new situation. Honestly, I'm running out of options, but you know me. I'll get creative. Anyway, I hope you're good. Is Lauren still there? Remember when you fucked her up? LOL. Miss your dumbass. Cindy. At least she cared. More than I can say for most. Dear Al Alex, I wouldn't blame you if you threw this letter out before even opening it. If you're reading this, thank you for giving me a chance to apologize. I wasn't ready. I wasn't cut out for being a foster parent. The stress, the arguments, the shouting, it was too much for me, especially at my age. I should have known better. I'm sorry if I made things worse for you. Good luck out there, Ms. August. I really wish those meds had worked. Chelsea. Right. 
It's a rare bright spot from my time in the group home. Dear Alex, happy birthday. Here's hoping you're having an absolutely fabulous day and that you don't have to deal with a single shitty thing from sun up to sundown. Real talk, though, I want to thank you for all the things you've done for me since we've met. I've felt safe and happy and even loved when you're around. Pretty unusual for people like us, right? Anyway, thank you for being you, for being my friend, for the way you beat Harley's ass, for letting me wear all your clothes even when I don't ask. I don't want to sound like a loser, but you're basically the only good thing in here. Aw, oh, look, there's Shoo Shoo in us. Okay. Alex. Do I want to know? Uh, yes. Time to snoop. Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Alex placed a group home in Portland area. Anita and Eduardo. They were one of the good ones. Hello, Gabe. Eduardo and I were very happy to hear from you. We are glad to see you're doing so well after all these years. Colorado is very far away. Sadly, it was difficult to keep talking with Alex after she was taken into the system, and we don't know where she lives now. Wow. Gabe's been looking for me for a while. Wow. That's nice of him. Unless his plan is to murder us. I don't know what to expect from these games. Ooh, what's Riley a letter? So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview and Mac thought they were sleeping together? This is fucking stupid. Oh my God, dump him, Riley. Gabe, ah, it's happening. Please, please help me prep. Hold when the aura icon displays to see the emotions attached to the object. Okay, so that's what that is. Sorry if I wasn't doing that right away. I don't know if that just popped up or I missed it. Right, I'm telling you, his story doesn't add up. He wants you. He's helping me get into college, baby. You know dudes can do nice things without the expectation of getting laid, right? A high school dropout? A guy who went to fucking juvie? Wants to be your study buddy? What, out of the goodness of his heart? Oh my god, Mac, we're friends. There is nothing going on between Gabe and me. Time to dump him, girl. Where's Riley? Dump him. Dun, dun, dun. So that was that noise earlier. There was probably an item in the record store that I could have done that with. Get dressed. Ooh. I mean, I like our outfit right now. It's cute. <gasps> Bird shirt. Oh. Okay. Hmm. 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 I mean, these are all nice. I like the plaid pants. I mean, we could let Steph know loud and clear. <laughs> We're gonna go with the plaid. Oh yeah, look at me now. Look at me now. Let's see some photos. Ah, uh, it's like ripped. Crazy how much we've changed. Can I emotion that letter? No way. Oh, there you go. Guess Gabe didn't cut out our parents. How mature. Look at them. Mom's healthy, dad's only kind of an asshole. There's that rip though. Yeah, right. Like <laughs> maybe he bent the photo for a while. Okay, no, we can't do it with that. Ooh, where's the food? I'm starved broadcasting straight from your local record store. Because how fucking cool is that? At least I held it together in front of Ryan and Steph. Did we though? Did we? I mean, we did though. We did. Whoa. Looks like Ryan turned my brother into a model citizen. Oh, wholesome. <gasps> Look at 
Look at this view! This is so cute. Can we see the mountains too? Do we have a balcony? Dude. And we got a fireplace. I don't know. It looks a little sketchy. Yo, this is nice. This is nice. <gasps> Sword. Oh my god. Why don't we attack the guy with that? We should have. We should have. <gasps> is that... He busted in, attacked my brother. I thought he was going to kill my brother, so I stabbed him. We didn't even get to finish the song. Must be Ethan's. Wonder how many times Gabe's been forced to play. <laughs> huh. They've really changed the art style since I read these. What is this art? Charlotte made this? Gabe mentioned she was an artist, but I didn't realize he meant, like, professionally. I could never make something so personal. I am an artist, Trip. Fuck you. All right. Oh my gosh, guys. My game is, like, actually so broken. It's... <laughs> Holy shit. It looks like Gabe actually read this. Uh, chapter four is the most important. Let's discuss it over wine. I love you. Well, that's nice. He actually read it. You know. The minimum. I'm really happy for you, Gabe. Aw, cute. Cute. Oh, come and play foosball. Is there only that one item? Let's see. Yeah, it looks like that was the only item where we could do the extra thing. Okay, let's keep unpacking then. Or journal. My journal. Time to add my latest meltdown. Woo! It was a good meltdown though. Like, let's look on the bright side. Oh, not everyone is bad. Mac, anger. It all started with a knock. I think I felt something off before Gabe even opened the door. Yeah, because it was like busting on the door like the police. Like something was slipping under the frame. Something red, something raw. Then there's Mac and that familiar feeling of dread that always comes when I know I'm losing control. And no matter how hard I fight it, it just keeps coming until my bo blood is a running boil. Then the part where my whole body has already made the choice to hurt someone and it's going to happen and no one can make me stop. Mac's anger felt hot and dizzy and also a little bit afraid. Really, it was all about Riley. The thought of her with someone else, the thought of her with anyone else, it was under his skin burning. That feeling like hot cords grinding around behind your ribs, it's one of the most exhausting feelings in the world. It's such a relief when it's over, when your ears stop ringing and your heart slows down from hummingbird to lazy jackhammer. Such a relief, too bad it cost Gabe a punch in the mouth. How do you apologize for something like that? These threads that bind us up, they burn and weave. Inside my ribs, they hurt until you leave. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, there were other pages. Shit, go back. I lied. Ugh. I'll finish this later. Dude, don't leave our journal right out in the open, though. Someone's gonna snoop in it. <gasps> What's that? Oh, guitar. Maybe. <gasps> oh, that's so nice. No fucking way. That's so nice. It's a little something to say. Welcome home. Can't wait to hear you shred. Wow. Thanks, bruh. Tune it. Well, Alex, 
You just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? Like, I need to shit. Or we can sing. We can sing, too. That's fine. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. We can't hear her sing. Or it would get copyrighted. Well, I can sing for her if you guys want. I know you guys want that. Someone's such a good singer. Don't worry. I beat the shit out of this dude who fucked up my brother. I got really angry and I popped him in the head. One day soon I'm gonna have him dead. <laughs> oh my god, so bad. I'm so sorry. We'll just skip. Skip, bitch. They can't even give us, like, the lyrics, though. <laughs> like, where are the lyrics, at least? You and your damn surprises, Gabe. Wow. Awe-inspiring. <laughs> Okay. How are we all? What's next? Yeah, keep the note. That's being here is too good to be nice. true. I'm not gonna let anything mess it up. Besides murder. I mean what? Mm -mm. I should go downstairs and set things right with Gabe. What if we have to shit? Wait, I missed this. Oh, man. Oopsies. Gabe used to crush me. Jerk. So, so far, I mean, feels like pretty long intro. We just learned more about, like, uh, her condition. Or, like, it... They're kind of like Ryan, powers in the it. games. I don't know. I'm sure we'll use it to our yourself. advantage at, at some time. Got patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, it looks pretty nasty right about here. <laughs> so, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? Put some ice on it. I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. It was fun. <laughs> I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing. Now you just go with him. Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Dude, we need the old guy upstairs well, with us, the boss. And my backup bartender. He looks like he'll stab someone for you. Or shoot him, maybe even. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So, what's it doing today? Well, <laughs> a rise. Actually, you know what? Rising. I'm going to look on the positive. Positive rising. things have been good. For sure. First day of my new life. Oh, good. I'm glad Max's stupidity didn't ruin everything. We know how to beat a dumbass dude's he ass, so worth. Comic. Worth. He obviously thinks you're really cool. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. Cool. By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope he won't be mad at me. Well, don't snitch on him that right I thing. said it. Beef I pie guess special. He'll know. Watch the gravy. <laughs> Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival, and they have to be done tonight. Sorry, I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah. Didn't she have nice Same. teeth? Bye. Thanks for supper. Yep. Yo, you got some shots for me, boss man? I'll take some shots. 
Oh god, that guy's still in here. Why is he still in here? The hell? You didn't kick his ass out? What the heck? Like what? Oh, she looks she's thinking about going to hit on her. So I'm short staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years experience as a server? Uh Maybe not as long as that, but yeah, I've done lots of things. Bend the truth a little bit. You want to work a shift? See if you might like it here? Sure. All right. So we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. She's like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, I got to check uh, on her. There's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? Got it. It's really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. No, seriously, why is this asshole still in here? Did no one like fucking kick his ass out if he won't leave? Call the police and get his ass trespassed. What are we doing here? What in the hell? All right, Ducky and Diane. I should check on that table. I should check on that table. Yes, we will. Can I get you to anything? Miss Chen, here at last to relieve our suspense. Uh, okay. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third Ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired, and this young woman is Diane. Oh my hey God, sugar daddy nice situation or what? I didn't realize that- uh, That we all knew you were coming. Yes, Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from DC six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? I just got here like 15 minutes ago, dude. Calm down. I didn't really know what to expect, but it's kind of perfect. <laughs> it feels like a home. I haven't I know, even slept here I yet. I really thought I would hate it. Then I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. My dad was in the service. My dad was, what? New dialogue and like, oh shit. Drama, what's up? Why are you sad? Is that sad? What is that? Maven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Liar! Both get there soon. You fake bitch. Oh. Is it the same thing? Maven is nice. Yeah. Just wish it felt like home. Yo, I have to put an order in, dude. Hey, Dad. Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Uh, cheeseburger with mushrooms. Wait, oh God, do you say burger or cheeseburger? Dude, cheeseburgers are so much better. But I feel like you said a burger with mushrooms. No. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. Oh God. And uh -huh. a pie and? special with fries. One pie special with fries. And uh, the, the drink. Ducky asked for his usual? Yes. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Wow. Where's my personal oh, bottle, odd. bitch? I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? And yeah. I'm going to have to go get the bottle. Serves him right if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. 
Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. I don't there think must I be saw something it. Something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Typhon's not a bad oh, company. new miner. Once you get used to how they operate. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Uh, and here we gotta go talk to her. Do, do, do. Totally doing things. Oh, enter the order in the computer. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> That's the girl from the record store. Steph. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though, if you want to chat. I'm over it. No. <gasps> oh no, someone was there. Who are you sitting with? Is that record store inventory? Let's not come on too hard. <laughs> no, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? Sure. Live action role play, right? Fantasy fighting in real life? Yep. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Would you ever want to join us sometime? Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. Blech. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a play. short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? Yeah, she has nice teeth too. Dude, you're on. <laughs> yes. Oh wait, I can't guess the song because it's not gonna play because I can't play copyrighted so, music. Oh god. I'll pick a song. You have uh, five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. Okay. I don't think I can do this technically. <laughs> We're gonna have to take the shot or five shots. Wait, is it? You just get one wrong. Oh, you only get an opportunity to get one wrong, I think. Got one. Jukebox is all yours. So, what do you want to ask me? Hmm. I should flip through these and see what might be good to ask. Okay. The fuckadelics? Cover art. Are there people on the cover? No. Yeah, no. Personal questions. All right, wait, song title. Does the song have a long title, like four words or more? Yes. Interesting. Okay. Mm. Is the band name only one word? Just it is more than one word. Okay, more hmm. than one word. You've got two questions left. Maybe. Is there an animal on the cover art? Uh, no, no animals. Ugh, too bad. Some of these are really cute. I know, right? Last question. Yeah, all right, I know. Oh man, okay. Is the band name on the cover? Yep, that's your five. Ready to guess? Maybe this one. Yeah. Let me look through one last time. Here's what I know. 
It's not a one-word band name. The song title is at least four words long. No animals on the cover. No people on the cover. The band name is on the cover. Hmm. Think that's enough to figure it out? Maybe. We'll see. All right, I'm gonna go with this. Guess. Did I do it? <laughs> Fuck. Yes! Nice one. <clears throat> Easy. Guess I'm drinking? <laughs> Guess you're drinking, bitch. glad we did. Me too. So, you and Ryan hang out a lot? All the time. Except when he ditches me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. <laughs> Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Luke and family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? What? It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he said- I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Tell Sorry, me, Jed. tell me. Oh, I'll find out, Jed. He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Interesting. I should get back to work. Okay. There must be something around the Whoa, Black Lantern she that wants can this help dick. Find prized whiskey. She wants this dick. Or whatever. You guys know what I mean. This week? You kidding? I've been waiting for this all year. Don't fucking give me a side eye, bitch, just because I'm being a weirdo. We'll go from there. <laughs> Teller's Peak? Bullet hole, huh? Yep. And Is Mount Huron. Just and the Devil's hole? Tail. Amazing. We love holes. Damn. I wonder if the bullet's still in there. Wow. Let's go talk to this bitch. not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Okay, so like she can keep it together sometimes, which I guess kind of figured like cuz we could check on some of these things. Let's go creep. <laughs> I know I just beat your ass, but I'm just going to stand here. Idiot. You're going to lose her. You're going to lose her and it's all your fault. At least he's right about something. Dude, you need to stop being a toxic asshole. Wow. I messed Mac up pretty good. Why can't we tell him that? Stop it. How mysterious. <gasps> Amelia, Amelia Goldstein, operated bed and breakfast for nine years, known for its beautiful rooftop garden. She died at the age of 32 of influenza. Though married shortly before her death, the identity of her husband remains a mystery. Oh, okay. Jed, he's pretty old. I don't know if he's that old, though. Wait, dispensary coupons? Coupons there? for weed? What a time to be alive. I'll take some. I want to play. Let's play Scram. <laughs> oh, wow, they hate me. Haven seems pretty serious about this festival. Baking bread competition? What? I'm joining. Anna Cruz competition. Raffle, whatever. 19 lives? Jed is a real hero. Wow. I saved a life today, our brother's life. I mean, basically. <laughs> Please, game. Oh my god. I don't know. I like have to restart the game after this episode because it is a mess for me. I still have like this huge black square covering up like a portion of the game. It's like slightly transparent though, so it's like doable. This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. <laughs> okay, so it's 2019. All right, let's go get, let's go get the bottle. 
Ooh, let's go take a pill. Restaurant review. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. I'm, you know, we're personable. Look, I'm going upstairs for this dude. It takes a lot of effort. I better get a good ass tip too. He said he's entrepreneur. He looks rich as fuck. Ducky better give a fat tip. All right. Let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Oh, wait, I didn't see this before the postcard. Or the crack. Excuse me? Crack? It's just a crack in the wall, unfortunately. Greetings from Mexico. Okay. <laughs> Looks like we've both had people trying to help us. Got your letter. I'm glad it made a difference for Gabe. Got your letter yesterday. I'm doing just fine. If you ever need a reset, come down this way because holy smokes, the food is great and the drinks are even better. I'll never get tired of hearing how great things are going for you. Some days I think about our first meeting at the detention center. Sure, you told me to fuck off three times, but i never seen anyone listen so intently to every word I said. I knew right then that you'd outplay the hand you were dealt. Point is, you were the best kid I ever mentored. Never, don't forget it. Let me know how it goes with Alex. Wow. I know I kicked the drywall crack when I see one. We go to the roof. No. <gasps> Memories from the first life is strange on the roof. No. All right, whiskey, where are you? I see ya. There it is. No, oh no, that's not it. Dude, where is this damn whiskey? Liquor. Maybe Ducky left his whiskey up there. Nope. Nothing. Oh, that's a water bottle. What if the whiskey was in the bed? Like. And they were hooking up. I don't want to go there. I don't think Gabe would cheat on his girlfriend. But hey, with Ducky too? I mean, that'd be some good drama though. Ooh, now I know where the ramen is. No whiskey though. Oh, I can search the couch. Duh. I somehow missed that. Even though I knew that's where it was. <laughs> we're just going to pretend it didn't happen. All right. Perfect. Perfect. <gasps> Are they going to load me in downstairs? That would be very nice of them. Good. Whoa. Found this above upstairs. and beyond. In... Gabe's couch? Really? Must All have out. been a night. Many thanks, Alex. <clears throat> My pleasure. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. To Miss Alex Chen. A most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Whoa. And I'm doing shots with them. I better get a good ass tip. <sighs> yeah. <sighs> Here, I'm making noise too. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. My dad was in the service. My dad was in the service. My dad was in the service. Shut, Shut the hell up. I am done. Glad you could fill in today. Where's my money? Do I get paid on the spot? Ooh, I want food. Where's my free food? Venison and leek pie. I need to try that. Oh, good. Oh, let's look at the photo. Oh, is that really Ryan? Wholesome. Oh, yo. Wait, why can't I talk to you? Because you're just an emotion. Starting over from scratch like this? Fucking terrifying is what it is. 
You're telling me. What's the ballot notice? Um, this measure proposes selling property of no more than 20 acres to Typhoon Mining for use in an open pit mine. Yeah, we need to keep some of the nature. Like, damn, dude. Just keep some. I don't want the mountain it's being all blown for sure. up for lithium. Keep some of it. Hey. Oh, okay. Hey. Oh, we're so weird. We're so weird. Oh my God, she hates us. No, she doesn't. I'm overthinking. <gasps> All right, uh, so anyways, anyone else feeling emotions? I have some advice. Oh God, Jackie has advice. No one asked, dude. No one asked. That looks interesting. Like, Yeesh. hotel keys? Glad I'm not a 19th century miner. Each miner removed his check tag as he entered the mine or replaced it on the board when he had safely exited. Yeah, that's some dangerous stuff. That's why I snitched on the kid. Like, at least ask an adult to go with you. Oh, Holy God. shit. Can I talk to you real quick? You better be apologizing. What do you want? Listen. What happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Don't both of us. No, no, no. Don't both of us. I was defending my brother. That is bullshit. And you know it. I was defending Gabe from you. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I'll do it again, bitch. Ah! Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps. To recap all the gory details, you know? You should get dumped. <laughs> you really are a piece of shit. Big, big piece of poo. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. So please. Help me out. Well, I don't know. Maybe you could have trusted your girlfriend of four years, you bitch. Know, Shit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god. Look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? She probably does want Gabe's dick, though. Why do you give a shit? I would if I'm her. Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. He doesn't. Spoiler. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About... Why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me. <laughs> okay. Um, not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Oh, God. Were you there too? Dump him, girl. Uh, call out his bullshit. I told yeah, her I'd I be there. honest. I'm being Mike's honest. telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, then I beat his ass. <laughs> what happened to Mac's face? I did that. Oh, good. It sounds like he deserved it. He did. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Yeah, I said I would Wait. earlier. Wait, are you, are we okay? Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. Dump are him. We still together. Make what a you scene. Think, you fucking idiot. No. Whoa. <laughs> Alex Chen. 
Oh, fuck. Uh, Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? Excuse the fuck me. No. No, no. No, no, here we are. What is this? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. What is this corrupt shit? <laughs> Come on now. They would arrest the other dude too, at the very least. Mac assaulted Gabe. He's the one you want. <laughs> your face. <laughs> you see your face. Yeah, it was so fucking oh, funny, you stupid bitch. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding. No, nobody's in trouble here. I, <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. That's not a prank. <laughs> I was about to contact my lawyer. <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um... Maybe I'm working right now. No, go well, buy me some weed. I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? Fucking <sighs> asshole. Dude, you're on my shit list now. Some of these people are on my shit list. He's on it. I don't like the cops pulling that shit. <laughs> that was too real. It's like when people online fucked with me and my boyfriend at our house. And the cops blame us. Even though we're the ones being harassed. Ugh. I'm triggered. For real, for real. You trigger my minor PTSD, you bitch. Fight me. Wait, can I? Damn, is that prank out of line? Yes. Did I come on too strong? It was, it was fucking bold. out of line. I'll give you that. No, Alex, it was out of line. Beat its ass. Let me beat its ass. <laughs> That's hysterical. Am I still fucking working here? Dude. What do you want? <laughs> do you still need something? Miss Chen. No. My dad was in the service. My dad was, if I see, hear her say that one more damn time, spooked patron, what's your problem, dude? Christ, she did that to that guy's face? Steering clear. Yeah, Aww. you fucking better. I'm already making friends. Guess these were for mining. I want to blow up. I, I want to blow up a mountain. I, I don't really want to, but like, I want to do it in the game. Jed, am I done working yet? Are you finished up with everything yes. you want to do? Yes. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. All right, thanks, thanks Jed. How, wait, we'll how much am I getting paid? Did okay. we discuss my wages? Time to talk to Gabe. I know how Colorado is. With some places, people can't afford to live there on the wages they're given. You better not fuck me over, Jed. Or we'll see what happens. I'm a wild bitch. I will explode you in the mountain and no one will know. Oh, butterflies. So cute. Oh, my cat's like wanted to attack it. She likes to watch me play video games. I just bought a new camera because my lens was broken and it was really expensive to replace. So maybe I'll do some face cam. You guys see my uh, gorgeous uh, face. So I'll just wait for that. Um, how's your jaw? Why is the brother mad at me? How's your jaw? Like, dude, the brother's pretty hot. Is the pain bad? 
and Alex. Everyone looks pretty good. Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... Well, thank you. Just what I wanted to put on beer weight. <laughs> I just want a big old beer belly now. What? Right. I... Beer belly. Did you rehearse that move? No. Only in my mind. <laughs> so, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, Dude why I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. You're pissing now me off. Now that we're talking about it. Not my fault I'm a good fighter. Guess I never realized. I saved your ass, dude. That I can kick your ass. I think the brother would kick our ass though. Yeah, I guess. If he really tried. We'd get you know, I eaten. I never realized what your life must have been like. On your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. I guess I did hit him. <laughs> Didn't you go to Juvie? Isn't that like prison? Yeah. That was the hardest time in my life. Some days of that. I didn't think I'd make it out. But I get the feeling you've been through worse. Once a crackhead threw a fart blanket on me. <laughs> that was pretty disgusting. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? Tell him about your past, tell him about your power. I mean, I feel like he should know. That way we have like, someone really close to us who's aware like in case we need help just like if we lose control that could be like a problem a big problem depending on what's going on there's something off about me I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid, I feel it too. And then I lose control. And this has happened for a long time. I mean, people are pretty emotional, so, you know. Uh. Like Mac. I felt all that anger like it was my own. Oh, God. I think she... it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. Could she feel like lust it's and more like than that. lose control that way? He wasn't just angry at you. He's angry at himself. He thinks he's going to lose Riley. I mean, he, she did just dump him, so, like, he kind of did. Did Riley tell you that? <laughs> no. No one told me that. I just feel it. I mean, it was pretty obvious, too, you know. Just based on context clues and his anger toward you, but... <laughs> you know, you can also have a superpower, sure too. Sure, it's not just 
you know. It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds or stress or trauma or whatever. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? It doesn't work like that. It's only when you feel really strong emotions. Oh. I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. Uh, I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. <laughs> Getting beat up and having no friends? That's a super curse, dude. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there. I mean, that's, that's really special. Special. That's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? I mean, I did beat some ass earlier. On. It was satisfying. I'm here for you. Don't forget that. Was that was pretty special. Ah, See, I knew I should tell him. I hope the brother's never an asshole. Wow, we live here. It's so nice. Gorge. So... When were you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Thanks. <gasps> Who's this and what do they oh, want? Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Oh. Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. You don't think... I do think, yes. Maybe? Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now, let's go. This kid really is gonna die in the mountains, isn't he? I knew it. I knew as soon as he said it. Gonna fucking die in the mountains. I try to warn everyone he's gonna die in the mountains. Keep an eye on your damn kid. No one listens. Now he's dead. Being eaten by wolves, probably. Bone by bone. Whatever. I tried. Now we gotta go find his dead body. At least we won't feel the emotion, because he'll be dead. Ethan? Ethan! Come on, pick up, pick up. Does he have like a cell phone? We can look for clues in the comic. Alex. There was like a snake thing. I'm sure he, like, wrote about things he saw. This way. You want to make out? <laughs> I mean, what? <laughs> yeah, let's look for the... Let's look for the kid. That That's more wow. important. Been a while since I was up here. Shh. 
Should I be... I don't know... Freaking out right now? In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. They're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey. You good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. They really just this like... Kid. <laughs> Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? Don't go up to the mountain. Hey. What did you think we're he would do? Him. You had to keep an eye on him. Yeah. yeah, you're right. Hey, thanks again for your help. Could have been a lot worse if you hadn't kept me in the loop. Of course. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. I can do that. I'm assuming there's no way How to stop this from happening. To get into the mine. What did it say? Something tells me those two weren't the best match. One of your neighbors has changed the relationship status. <laughs> Riley's now single, proud of you, sweet. Ouch, Mac. Ooh, let me re let me put a note too. Hilarious. Landed Ooh, a can job I talk on shit back? Day. Let me Maybe reply. Maybe this first start is still salvageable. <gasps> Missing dog. Do you think we can find it? It's like a little Easter egg. Let's find the dog, not the kid. Fuck it. Ah. You don't realize until you're up close, but mining equipment is super murdery. <gasps> Dude. Wait, he talked about the dead person in the in the comic. How is the rubber zombie the least creepy thing out here? Maybe that's what he meant. And then there was a snake that you could like walk across. Huh. I mean, there's like a tunnel which is long like a snake. There's this tube. Wait, that has an emotion attached. I got you. I got you. It's okay. You're okay. Oh, God. Oh, God, we're alive. Is that everybody? I need a head count. Ah, uh, yes. The Great Jed Mine Collapse of 1818. They were gonna set off charges tonight. Thank God Gabe got a hold of them. Oh my god, what if they blow up the kid? I don't mean to laugh, but... <laughs> you know, it's a game, so... <laughs> Julie is a fucking skank. Wow. Maybe Julie McNamara doesn't need your approval. My joyride in this will have to wait until after we found Ethan. All right, I mean, they're all over here, so maybe we'll go that way. I want to look around a little bit. Wow. Once Ethan's safe, I'll raise one too. Cool. Alex warned me. I could have stopped this. I'm such a fucking fuck up. Gabe cares about Ethan so much. We have to find him. Yeah, I was so butthurt about me punching him when saving him. He allowed the kid to die. This is your fault. No, I'm sorry, Gabe. Anyways, why uh, can I select? Okay, there it goes. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Brian won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. Wasn't working for a second, right? Imagine being trapped down there. Or actually, don't. What if we get exploded in the mine? We won't. I doubt it. What happened here? Massive cave-in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. That was in the comic, God. too. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, 
basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. He had to find another way in. Huh. Okay, yeah, 10 hours later, she finally <laughs> takes out the comic. Same logo. Yeah. Did Ethan base his comic on this place? Duh. Okay. Thanks, game. I would have okay. never figured it out. If the wall is an illusion. All right. There's the zombie. Blood. Follow the blood. Hollow. Okay. Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind of me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. <gasps> oh, there. wow. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look then. Okay. Ethan based his comic on this plate. Alright. Zombie guy? Then there was something hollow. Yep, probably. I think there's like a side door back there. I don't know. You can guess there might be. Give me a hand. Okay. <sighs> you figured that out from a comic book. Oh yeah, I'm a real sleuth. Did you get your checks? I better begin my check soon and better be a good ass wage, Jed. I'm gonna try to get the lights on. You try to figure out where Ethan went. All right, where's the snake? So big long pipes are snakish. There's many a snakish things in here. <laughs> Ethan must have come through here. How did he get out? Old. Have I got some good news for you? Hmm. I mean, it, it seems like a slim chance, but. What? Ethan must have gone upstairs. Yes. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. Okay, but then how did he get out of here? Not sure. I'm gonna have a look. Space to swap between places and objects in conversation. That's new. All right, snake. Caution. Window. Conveyor belts? Is that, oh, maybe that's a snake. The silo. We're getting close. Yeah, that's it. That's it. It was just like that in the comic. Doo, doo, doo. And you can get on it, right? Yeah. So this place was a death trap when it was operational too. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> yeah, we love death traps. All right, uh... We passed caution like an hour ago. How do I do that then? That's definitely... That's gotta be it. I guess there's like... This conveyor belt over there too? Is that? Yeah. 
Okay, I'll stay out. But not because you told me to. Wasn't in the comic. Hmm. Yeah, there's a number of conveyor belts. Not in the comic. Okay, there it is. That's it. I just couldn't find where to click it. Okay. Yeah. Correct. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. I think I'll find another way through. It looks more looks safe. Like Ethan climbed oh. the conveyor belt out to the silo. Yikes. Worth a shot. Heads up. You figured out the door. Yeah. Turns out you got to open it. Who knew? A mystery. The wonders never cease. So we can just go down there then? I'm not going via conveyor belt. Fine. If I must. Wait, where's the door? How do I get over there? run we haven't been able to run Ugh. let's hope omens aren't really a thing <laughs> yummy maybe the kid ate it for dinner a oh, mattress let's squat in here nope thanor doesn't battle any bed bugs all right there we go i'm not okay but it's okay Ooh, overalls overalls so much stuff just left behind let's make an outfit thanks for nothing giant yellow button where did gabe go oh he's already out here what took you so long you never forget how to break a lock it's like riding a bike where to next alex Well, we had to go. We should have just gone via the conveyor belt. Unless it's easy to get up there from here. Ah. They'll do it for us. Thanor looks Full out moon. through the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. If we can just convenient there that's where he's heading that's by the ravine shit let's go oh he's dead in the ravine now we're too late man this dead kid really needs to be dead on my first day in town <laughs> oh, I mean, I hope he's not dead. I just got a bad feeling from We're the close? start. I think so. Ethan! 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 I just watch all these YouTube videos on people like dying in mines and caves and stuff. Oh no, there's a purple fart. What is that? Oh, he's okay. That's good. How'd you get over there? Ethan! The sketchy tree? Alex! I'm scared! 
Oh god, I'm gonna lose control and fall in the river and I'm gonna die. No. Ethan, I'm coming for you, buddy. Wait. Hold on. Oh Ethan? God, just get a rescue helicopter or you something. Okay? Let's not be dumb about this. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. Just hang on. Go grab a ladder. <laughs> There's gotta be one by the mine. No! Oh my god. No! His fear is so strong. If I get near it... It's no good. We're too heavy. I don't like say something to the brother like, I can't. What about me? Wait, what? Hey, Alex. I'm gonna lose it. Uh, are you sure? Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Awesome. Show me. You okay? No. Honestly? No. And that feeling makes sense. Do me a favor, though. See if you can breathe. I don't know if breathing Great. helps. As long as you keep My doing power. that, everything's gonna be fine. Alex, can you make eye contact with me? I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum to feed rope your direction. Follow? All right, at so least far. we're using tools awesome. now. Doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. Steady is fast. Piece of cake. Oh, man, you really tied Piece us up cake. good. We'll remember that for later. Oh no, I'd be on all fours. Ass up. Ass up. Hang on, Ethan. For my balance. I'm coming. Run. You got this, Alex. Don't look Go at back. him. You will get hurt. I fucking warned you, bitch. I'm not going back without you. You're stuck with me until we're both safe. Oh my god, I'm a hero like Jed. Hey, Do I get a plaque Ethan? if I save him? I'm here to help, okay? No! Get away! Uh-oh. Shit. It's too much. I have to get him to chill out. I liked your comic. <laughs> it was so good. Ethan, I need you to calm down. Can you breathe for me? I should never have come out here! I was so stupid. Okay, hey, hey, focus. Talk to me. You want to tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. The log fell. That's fine. That's okay. Let's talk about what comes next. Gabe's got us. We're not gonna fall. He's got the other end of the rope. No, I can't move if I move. You're not gonna fall, buddy. It doesn't matter. He's not making any sense. I need him to calm down. We can't stay here, Ethan. We have to- It'll see me. If I move, it'll see me. What's gonna see you? Um. You don't understand. He's right. I don't. You got a power too? I can't help him if I don't understand what he's afraid of. And the only way to understand is to feel what he's feeling. We get to ask too. <laughs> oh fuck. I can't believe this is happening. 
You could just ask. All right. I can do this. I can do this. feels. I'm seeing the world like he sees it. I thought I could hurt the monster, but it's hunting me. I'm the monster. Get over here. Oh. Darn it, game. I'm warning would it be afraid, but he's just a story. This is real. Okay. He's not afraid of the fall. He's afraid of... Oh, shit. Can't let it see me. Can't let it see me. It can't be real. Oh, but it looks pretty fucking real. Hey. Hey, I see it too, Ethan. The monster? I see it too. And I'm just as scared as you are. But Ethan, we're safe. You know why? It can't see me. Bangle of vanishing, just like Ninth Warden. Whoa! I thought that was just a story. It's not. Well, some stories are true, like monsters. So, you're gonna hold my hand, all right? As long as you're touching me, you're safe. Yes, we did it. Don't look down, okay? We'll be done before you know it. Drop him in. <laughs> Alex? Yeah, buddy? I'm still really scared. This seems so dangerous, having them walk. No, nothing Alex? to be scared of. Shit. What? I literally clicked that. Dude, my game is sketchy. It just made him way scareder. <laughs> it's not good. Do you think the log will break? Yeah, totally. I don't know, but if it does, I am gonna hold on to you so tight. We're okay? barely holding on okay. to him. Look, oh my god! Like loop him through one of the ropes or something. Get on all fours. Or they could—they should have like left me a little extra rope to put on him. Okay. Ten years later. Oh, well, we're slowly making our way downtown. How has everyone been? Oh, there we go. Yay. Now we're not even holding on to him. Dude, this is just fucking run. Just fucking run. We're so close. Leap. That's it. Come on. There you go. I got you. Ay, ay, ay.
<laughs> We're a hero. Where's my plaque? <laughs> Put it next to Jed's. Where are my free drinks? My free weed? New free mountain house? Come on now. The mountain explodes. We all die. Uh-oh. That they were supposed to stop. This is a super dramatic moment, and the game is freaking out on my screen. Oh my god, because my fucking cat is being a bitch. You're the only person I could trust. All right, uh, 48%. Oh, wait, that's friends. Where's world's? Oh, no, that's world's deaths. 48% uh, of people told Gabe about Ethan's plans. Alex told Riley the truth about the fight, 70%. Alex told Gabe about her power, 74%. Wow. Uh, wow. Alex hugged Gabe on the bridge, 97%. Alex encouraged Riley to be honest in her interview, 74%. Alex put cool sunglasses on the gnome, 92%. Alex didn't stop at the listening station, 32%. Oh, I didn't even notice the listening station. Wait, didn't I? Actually, I did, didn't I do that? I just couldn't play the song. I don't remember. Alex told Ryan that Gabe was a dork, 49%. Alex rocked out with Gabe on the broom guitar, 95%. Alex found evidence of Gabe's search for her, 95%. Alex expressed optimism about Haven to Charlotte, 38%. Alex went along with Gabe's story, 44%. Alex told Gabe she loves the guitar, 96%. Jed was impressed with Alex's performance as a server. Oh, ho, 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 look at me. Seth lost to Alex in the jukebox game, 36 Riley broke up with Mac after a fight, after the fight, 73%. Good. That was a good moment. Ducky was reunited with his favorite whiskey, 91%. Dude, the brother... Man. Man. <laughs> He's dead, isn't he? He's probably dead. I don't want him to be dead. I liked the brother. Maybe he's just um injured. They really did the explosion, regardless of the missing kid. <sighs> Ooh, we're su we sue their ass. Sell his apartment. Sue the mining company. Boom. Easy money. But then we don't have our brother anymore, so that's sad. Um, I, what did you guys think of the first episode? Uh, I thought it was a little slow, like, at moments. Sometimes on these games, I could do a little without, like... Some of the small talk. I get you have to have some because you have to introduce characters and all that. But it, you know, it got a little more crazy at the end. So that's, uh. But not in a good way. Now I'm just sad. Now I'm sad. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna continue playing this. Uh, I'll have the next chapter out probably pretty soon. I wanted to do it all today, but. I actually have like my lymph node like swelled up by my ear and like it's kind of hard and kind of concerning kind of happened out of nowhere <laughs> so I don't know may I might take it easy today too but we'll see bye guys
Have a good one.